All right, in three, two, one. Oh, all right. How are you guys doing? I'm. I got Portal Two. Look, as you can see, Portal Two. All right, I'm gonna be playing the single player, and yeah, here, here we go. Auto saves, yes, that is good. I want auto saving. Oh, all right. Ooh, I wonder what I'm gonna I, I'm gonna expect from this. How's it gonna start and everything? Ooh, so what is today? Today is four nineteen two thousand eleven. I'm uploading a uh, unboxing. It's really short unboxing of Portal Two. So here we go. Come on. It's all destroyed. So if you played Halo, Halo, uh, Portal <laughs> One, you know at the end that you get shot out, like the, on the base of. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 50 days. What? In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. <laughs> Good. I think I know this how to look around. This is the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. <laughs> okay, I missed standing in front of this it. This is art. You will hear oh, a buzzer. Oh, it is art. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. I, I'm already staring at the art. I don't... Like where this is you going. Now feel mentally reinvigorated. Yes. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. This is really, really weird. Something is gonna pop out from that. Good. Now please return to your bed. No, I don't want to sleep. I want to look. Ooh, TV. <sighs> Does nothing. Can I sit? No, oh, look at that guy over there. What was the controls? What? I gotta hold down crouch. Oh, I don't like that. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Jump. Oh, I wasn't even in bed. Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. Oh. Nine. This Hello. Anyone in there? Hello? Hello? Are you going to open the door at any time? No. Hello? Are you going to open this door? Because it's fairly urgent. Yeah. I'll just open the door! Hello, friend! Ah! Oh, God, God. You look... Um... Good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? How are you... Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it slow. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. What? Stay calm. Stay, stay <laughs> calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Uh, I'm getting in the closet. You all right down there? Can you hear me? <laughs> this is so weird. Hello? They moved me. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. What? But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying? At all? Does any of this make yeah. any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. I, I, I am. Okay. What you're doing there is jumping. 
Uh, you just you just jump. <laughs> but never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. <laughs> uh, reactor core apparently, I can't talk. Please prepare for ah. meltdown. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? Ah. You're still holding on. The reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Uh -huh. <laughs> hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. It's a lot. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? Have I got enough space? Uh, just, just got to get through here. Okay, I just got to concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? <laughs> All right, see, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. Uh, robot, what are you doing? Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, all right? Not dead. Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Oh. Yeah. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override. On manual this override. You're just going to slam right on. Oh. Hold on. Don't push me into it. Almost there. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Oh, there we go. Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But um, at least you're a good jumper. So you got that yeah. little jumping on your side. Mm -hmm. um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Alrighty then. I just wanted to watch some TV. Oh, so glad. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance <laughs> beyond our control. However, oh. thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. Yeah. The portal will open, and emergency this is, testing this will is begin. The room from portal, three, two, from portal 1. one. Are these toilets still intact? That's always good. Well, I might as well put that in the toilet. Now, nah, whatever. How do I look? It's all grassy. Gardeners have been keeping up this place. Hume and button-based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button-based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Twice. Uh. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. Ooh. Thing. This place is really run down. Well, that's what's going there. The elevator. Ah. 
you see. Portal 2 has loading elevators. Just like the first one. Yeah. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. Ew. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Ew. So, um, can't hear anymore? It's all different. Like, uh, the doors are... Oh, the camera is dead. Yeah, no one's watching me. Probably need a cube to break that. Let's get cute. Now I'm gonna use it to break this. What? Break. 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 Okay, that that is not the right way to do it. Alright, go through here. Now we're getting somewhere. Now we're getting somewhere. What is this? All right, all right, fairly easy. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion okay. of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will remind you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. <laughs> that is not going to happen, I think. Who's this dude talking to me? There's like that robot. It sound like that. What was that one comedian? Uh, Ricky with the G. His last name is G. Whatever. He's uh, he's British. Kind of sound like him, but I don't think it was him. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I don't think animals are. I don't know what was happening actually. <laughs> oh, it's a turret. Oh, turret. You have animal fur on you. Hey, you made it. Yeah, I did. There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. Yeah. Who I put it? See it though. Who put it back? It fell off. Do you want to go? Oh! oh! <laughs> I'm alive. I'm gonna work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just gonna wait for you up ahead. Yeah, I am. I'll wait one hour. Followed. Someone must have been here before. And assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. All right, brilliant. Go team. See you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead. Hey. It's like uh me. It's like uh, an altar of sorts. Telling me the past. Oh, okay. This is really weird. Alright, they make flatos. And there are people freaking out. Edward Scissorhands came. Oh, I understand now. Yeah, Edward Scissorhand came with Companion Cube and freaked everyone out and killed them. See that guy's choking. She's, she's having problem, and that guy's laughing hilariously. All right, <laughs> he's jumping for joy. Oh, okay, great portal. On one. Does it matter on any surface? No. Okay. Ooh, oh, 
ঝুঁকবে না।